So that proved uh, a fairly popular draw, second round draw for the Ladbrokes Challenge Cup. Thank you to my beautiful assistants, Ollie Holmes and Ryan Hall, both pulling your old teams out at home. Your old boys, Normanton. Um, I know that'll be quite a popular tie for them and you'll be going to watch it. Yeah, it will be. Uh, uh, good that it's uh, another home draw for us. And, uh, you know, they played Shawcross a couple of years ago in, uh, in for the promotion spot in league, so it'll be a tasty match if they end up with them. And you got quite a big cheer for, for what you provided in the second round for your old boys here at Alton. Uh, yeah, it certainly uh, proved uh, very popular. Uh, I'll be, like, like Ollie himself, I'll be going uh, down to watch that fixture. Um, yeah, hopefully they'll get through to the next round, that's the main thing. Uh, they've got a home draw, which is favourable you know, for the accountants who uh, work here, so um, it'll be uh, good to see that tie. We are, of course, still a million miles away from Wembley, but what is it about this competition? and this famous trophy that, that so inspires so many players to want to, to reach the Holy Grail. I think it's just the fact that there's that much history involved, involved in the Cup, you know, it's, it's been going for over 100 years and, you know, it's, it's a knockout Cup, which is always one that's, that proves harder to win. So, you know, you've got to be on, on form on the day, maybe four or five times and, and it's yours, but it's easier said than done. Was this something you always dreamed of winning, right? It's, you have finally won it, it took a while, but was that always one of the, the career dreams for you? Yeah, certainly. Uh, after losing so many times, it was a bit, uh, became a bit of a drag, you know, the Challenge Cup, but, um, but I'm so glad that, you know, it's happened and we, you know, we got the win last year. And you can see how much it means to clubs of this level. We're here at Alton Raiders home, your, your old stomping ground, and just to be involved in the draw, to have it here, and then to have a tie as tasty as it was, the atmosphere was fa fabulous here. It shows what it means at grassroots level. Yeah, it certainly does. It's what um, it's where the magic starts. It's you know, it's the magical competition. It's like Ollie says. It's got a lot of history, and uh, Alton are a part of that. You know, even if the names on the trophy or not, it's you know they started it and they get the ball going. You boys don't need to worry quite yet about the Ladbrokes Challenge Cup Super League first and foremost. You must be ready to go now. Yeah, pretty sick of pre-season now. Uh... You know, it, it takes its toll on you, but it, it gets you ready for what you need to be. And uh, rolling into that first game, a bit of nerves about it, but, you know, I'm pretty excited. Quite a big game to start with as well for you. Yeah, local derby. Um, I think it's the first time I've had a, a starting home game for for as long as I can remember. So it'd be, it'd be good to get down a, down at Cass and obviously a local derby, so it'd be a bit tasty. Cass and Wakefield, for you, it's a, a trip to, to Hull KR with a, a huge crowd expected for that already. What kind of challenge does that provide for, for Leeds on weekend one? Uh, well, being a player going to Hull, it's quite a daunting thing, especially the first game when you haven't been playing around crowds like, uh, like we're expecting. It's a repeat fix of uh, the first season, uh, first game uh, last season, um, so we know what to expect. Well, we're looking forward to it. Great to have you both with us. Best of luck for the start of the new season.